Who was influential to you and who was maybe helping you navigate and guide um, this decision making process at the time? Do you remember who was kind of helping you navigate that? Right. So the legal aid was mm. really the only person uh, around to help me make these decisions. And, uh, you know, she was supposed to have my best interest at heart, you know, having dealt with children in my position, uh, you know, countless times. So she made her recommendation. She asked what I wanted and she represented me. I, I couldn't even step foot in the courtroom. But, you know, when we, you know, into like the mediation rooms or whatever they were called, that's when we were able to, you know, discuss what my interests were, what uh, she advises for for me, mm -hmm. and then what the interests of the parents are. And just a, a quick um, for full full picture, where was your dad in all this, your biological dad? Was he a part of this moment in time when you were deciding and what, you know, what was going to happen to you in terms of where you would be, you know, living and, and who would be taking you know, sort of care of you? So at, at that point, um, I believe he had already passed away. Okay. Um, he, he had a seizure and, you know, I'd probably spoken to him maybe four times in life. So, you know, we didn't have much of a working relationship at all. And, you know, I wasn't really allowed to speak to him or that side of the family until I went into foster care. And any of his family members involved? It doesn't sound like either. Just sort of your mom and her family potentially involved and then you Right, right. And, um, your, and, your, and your legal aid. Right, exactly, at that point, yeah. yeah. Um, they, they didn't come in until, you know, a little bit later uh, when I was around maybe 16 years old and, you know, the, the agency was trying to reach out to any, you know, like relatives That's that I right. had. So when they found out I had family in Florida and they were able to make contact with them, they got me down there for the first time and I met, you know, like a, a ton of people. I, okay. I was like, oh my God, who are all these people? I'm not gonna remember anybody's name. name. And I'm already bad with names. Right, so, right. you know, like it was it was overwhelming for me yeah. to go down there and meet all these people mm -hmm. and, you know, not really feel much of a connection to them because I don't know them, I wasn't used to them. And, it, you know, it's all foreign to me.